For many ECU students, makeup is a tool used to express themselves. For other students in the Greenville community, it's their livelihood. Deja McGeehern, a student esthetician at Alexander Paul Institute, says her love of makeup began at a young age. I was young, and this is probably sometime middle school, maybe elementary school, and I don't have any brows, okay, so my brows are really thin, and that was something I was always like conscious about. So I probably snuck into my mom's room and got a little brow pencil and that was like my first experience. Though some believe makeup is used to hide insecurities, Mickey Hearn says it should be used as a way to enhance the features you love about yourself. Really everybody just kind of needs to take a moment and look at themselves in the mirror and find the one thing that they love about themselves. One of Mickey Hearn's makeup looks included a fresh faced appearance on ECU student Sarah Spain, which combined a full coverage foundation, nude lip, concealer, and a slight highlight to create a dewy natural finish. I feel really good. It's like definitely different from what I usually do, but I feel like I can like run errands and just go to class like this. It's not too heavy, it's very lightweight. For Spain, makeup is a way to distress from the pressure of classes and everyday life. Well, it's fun for me because it's like therapeutic. It's like just spending time with myself and like no one else. And it's like the moment of day that you can be the most selfish. Mickey Hearn's second look of the afternoon featured winged eyeliner, bold lipstick, and defining contour for a going out look on model Liz Juno. Juno shares how her daring evening look brings a new level of fearlessness to her attitude. I feel like it's a little bit of a confidence booster and like you feel more like, hey, kind of thing. Model Kenna Peterkin debuted a 10 minute makeup look featuring minimal concealer, a light eyeshadow, and a glossy lip for students who want to avoid putting on full face makeup before early morning classes. It takes the last leg for me to put on makeup to go to class. Peterkin says that makeup for her serves as a pick me up. I think it just makes people feel better, basically, and I'm not just like playing with my face. <laughs> Being able to inspire confidence in a woman is something that Mickey Heron says is one of the highlights of her job. Definitely being here in school and being able to boost people's confidence, specifically with makeup, I mean that's 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 something that not everybody can say they do. Like I made like this person's day, you know, I made this I gave this person confidence. Like not everybody can say that, so being able to do that for people is really rewarding. Ultimately though, Mickey Heron explains that one of the greatest beauties is staying true to yourself. Me and my mom say this all the time and I can't take credit for this. If anybody watches Shameless Smile on YouTube, her big thing that she always says is do you boo. And I, I love it. I love that saying to death and me and my mom we say that all the time. Just be you. You know, like at the end of the day, do you. Try your hardest at being you and you will always succeed every time. This is Madison Lawson with Tech Video.